Corey is at engineering camp, and they decided to hold engineering camp at a place that has trampolines. I like it. Yeah. I'm sure there's a big yeah. connection. It's. <laughs> yeah, well, it's a wide open space, and that's what we need for what we're doing this week at Engineering for Kids. It's a great camp. By the way, kids, who loves engineering? <laughs> yeah, they do. And uh, it really is fun. They make it fun, and uh, they, they really get to kind of stretch themselves out. Now, this is Harper, this is Hudson. And this is Akeel. Now, since you're in the middle here, Harper, t tell me, or Hudson rather, what's your aim? You've got a drone in your hand. So do your friends. What are you going to be trying to do here? So we're each going to go to our sides, mm -hmm. and we're going to try to, each one of us is going to try to fly through our chosen drone or uh, oh, ring. Through your ring. Which ring are you going to try for? I'm going to try to go through this blue one. Okay, very good. And how about you, Akil? Which ring is yours? The yellow one. The yellow one over there. Very good. And Harper? Mine is this. This yellow. yellow one here. Okay. Now, before we set you guys off, I hope that you've got some cool features on your drones, like um, will fire shoot out of it? No. Wouldn't that make it a better drone if it shot fire? Yes. Yes. Wouldn't that be awesome? Or maybe, uh, maybe you could hover above Harper's drone and then drop acid onto it or something. Ooh, yeah. yeah, wouldn't that be awesome? Yeah. Okay, well, for now, we'll just do the regular drones. You guys take your places. <laughs> and uh, Zach Gray is with us as well. Now, remember, you guys, cheer for your favorites. Don't be quiet about it. You know you've got a, a winner uh, to cheer for. So, Zach, tell me what this week is like for these kids. Uh, and you guys start anytime. We want to watch the action. Uh, day one through the end of camp, what happens? Yeah, so day one, they start learning about the history of drone aviation, uh, unmanned flight. And then they progress through the week, get more technological with it. And then they really start automating them so that they just press a button and the things fly on their own. Can you imagine? Now, even when you were a kid, yeah. this was not happening. Can not you imagine that day? It's insane. Yeah. I get to play with these for my job. It's incredible. It's really fun. Oh, there we go. Nice work. Somebody went down out there. Now, uh, will all of these youngsters be able to operate drones uh, during oh, yeah. the week? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we, we keep our group sizes nice and small. We keep our instructor uh, to student ratio low. Mm -hmm. um, so that way the kids get as much of an opportunity to, do, to play with the cool tech and the things we offer. Very good. And uh, real quickly, we'll get together for another segment here in a moment. How do moms and dads sign their kids up if they're watching at home? They go to engineeringforkids.com slash Phoenix Metro. Very good. You know how it works. Uh, get on that, uh, get on your phone or any of your uh, mobile devices and get your youngster oh, signed up. It's going to be wow. a great summer Did for sure. All right. Off we Does go. Does it count, Corey, when it crashes after it goes through? Because the, the, the first kids got his through the blue one. Does it count if it crashes, or do you have to fly it all the way through? Uh, oh, no, I think almost. you can pick it up if it crashes. Oh, yeah. There, Very there, good. there, there. Um, is that her? Is that her? Yeah! That's what we're talking about. There we go. All right. That was we'll fun. Move. We'll be right back. Nice <laughs> job, kids. All right, Corey's spending the morning at engineering camp. Yeah. We saw him flying drones. Yeah. This looks fun. Now they're like oh. flying drones. Oh, look at that. We're just flying what drones. What is this? <laughs> flying kids. <laughs> We're flying kids. Well, we've motorized this Whoa. little girl oh and uh, seems to be working out pretty well. <laughs> Here comes another one. Look at this. Here comes they another one. They just launch themselves. Wow. I want to do that. I know. This is the best. And Zach Ray is still with us now. I assume we're learning some really cool lessons about physics and engineering with a ride like this. Uh, what are they experiencing here? So we teach them all about things like G-force, airtime, and that really ties into a lot of the curriculum we do, like drones. Uh, the drones really give them a chance to learn about things like thrust as well. Um, and it's kind of a way for them to really apply what they're learning in a really exciting and fun way. Boy, it really is cool. And we're here at Urban Air, and you, you tend to run your engineering for kids camps at places like this, a lot of wide open spaces, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're running out of different uh, locations, nine different locations. We're out at Main Event in Avondale. We're up at Sky Zone Peoria. We're up in Scottsdale at Octane and AZ Airtime. We're all over the place. So just check us out on our website. There's one close to you. Love that. And Dale Fidoa is with us. Dale, I've never seen anything like what we are seeing right now with these. What, what do you call this? Uh, this is, a, this is the, a, sky, a sky rider. The sky. Boy, it really is true. They... They really look like they're kind of uh, uh, propelling themselves toward their own uh, destiny, but 
the whole thing is so fascinating. I've never seen anything like it. Yeah, we are, uh, we're not just trampolines. We're in a full-size adve indoor adventure park. Well, the, it, it really shows, and boy, this looks terrific. We've got a, a whole, what's happening above our heads, by the way? Well, this is the ropes course. It's, it's uh, you just simply wa wander through and track your way through and climb your way through. It's pretty, pretty good engineering. Uh, the engineering for kids love to, to kind of like look at it and engineer their way through it. And that's I why I love it. We love well, partnering with them. Well, if you're not here for camp, but you're just coming uh, for the day, I know you have different levels of uh, of attraction, yes. so to speak. Well, what's the cost going to be for mom and dad? We're priced by attraction, not by time. We're not time-based. You can spend all day. We're, so it starts at uh, basic trampolines for about $13. Then it goes up to uh, about uh, $20 for the next level, which includes uh, the, the proprietary warrior course, obstacle course. And that's what we're looking at now. That's what we're looking at now. And then the next level is the uh, aerial package that's got the ropes course and the sky rider and everything. So, yes. Very good. Well, thank you so much, Dale. And, uh, Zach, one more time. Um, I know th it all looks like fun, and it absolutely is. They're learning as they go, and I love the way you guys are tying this kind of activity into your uh, learning experience at camp. And uh, once more, how do moms and dads get in touch with you guys? So go to engineeringforkids.com slash phoenixmetro. Very good. All right. Well, carry on, you guys. And, uh, Troy, I want to get on that that Skyrider thing. That was the best thing I've seen all summer, I think. Let's go yeah. Let's go look at that as we wrap I, I it up. I love it. And, and I I'm like impressed you, by that. You whip around. Look and you have, like, <laughs> Look at this little look, girl. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. so great. That is so great. I've never seen one of those before. Yeah. Never have. I like that. I, I could watch this all day long. Me too. Yeah. All right, send another one. I don't care if she's crying. <laughs> She'll stop eventually. She's not crying. Ow.